Hi everyone, I decided to start a YouTube channel on how to make bird toys for cheap. Um, I have two large macaws, so I know how expensive bird toys can be. Uh, this is Penny, my eight month old green wing macaw. I got her from somebody that took a new job and just didn't have the time to take care of her. And I have Ramsey, my three year old rev front macaw. I got him at three months old and ah. finished hand raising him myself. I know that toys get expensive for these guys, so I'm just going to do some few torture tu tutorial videos on making bird toys for cheap. So today I got a I'm going to do a toy with pieces that I got mostly for free. This is a piece of stainless steel wire. This will be my base. You do want to use stainless steel or nickel plated because anything else is pretty dangerous. You got to watch the metals with birds because they do chew them. Also with sizes of the, the wire for bigger birds, you want to use a larger gauge wire so they can't easily bend it, bend it and manipulate it. All right. So this will be my base. I looped at the bottom. I have pieces of drink carrier that I got from McDonald's, Burger King, Wendy's, anywhere I go through the drive through and order takeout and get a couple drinks I ask for a drink carrier. I keep all of them. Very cheap toy, free in fact. Pieces of cardboard. I took a cardboard box and I just cut it up into pieces. Another free toy. I have chunks of wood. These are two by sixes that I bought at Home Depot, untreated wood. I cut with my uh, miter saw and drilled holes in the center. I have a drill press. Uh, it makes it easier to drill the wood. However, you can use a piece, uh, a regular drill bit and drill to drill holes in your wood. You just want to make sure that your holes are big enough for whatever you're using to string the wood on. I have pieces of straw, straws that I um, cut in half. I got these are ones from restaurants with the paper on them. Um, the paper just adds for another extra feature of the toy. I also have paper cups that these um, are the ones that don't have wax in them. You want to make sure when you do get like paper products like this that you don't want to get the ones with the shiny wax inside of them and paper shred. Paper shred is another inexpensive thing you can buy at the Dollar Tree. Uh, Five Below has it right now. To, it's Easter time, so they have it for Easter baskets and stuff. You do want to make sure it's paper, not the plastic kind. So you just start with your base and you start adding things to it. And you can just poke poke at the wire through and add a piece of wood and some cardboard and you just want to keep adding things to the toy until you fill it all the way up. paper cup and some straws and I already um, pre punched these with a hole puncher um, you can uh, push the straws the wire through the straws sometimes it's a little hard to do it that way so using the hole punch is a little bit easier to do First, that way you can get the straws on easier. You just keep on stringing the toys on, or the pieces on to your base. And I'll come back when I get a little bit more further on it. Okay, here I have almost a finished toy here. 
I have a few more added pieces of the straw I'm going to add to it. And then what I'm going to do is take my needle nose pliers that seem to be missing now. Here they are. Take my needle nose pliers and then I'm just going to make a loop at the end of it so I can hook, put a hook on it. And you can use any hooks. Um, that you may have from any toys that you save. I save all my quick links from other toys that I use or have bought. And I say those are just reusable things, which are nice. But then I take some paper shred. I'm going to take some paper shred and add it into the cup, like so. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to end up dropping a walnut or um, almond or pistachio. I'm going to put some treats in these cups. And what it's going to do is it's going to add another foraging feature that is really nice for birds to be able to find treats in their toys and stuff like that. Because that's pretty much what birds do most of their time in the wild is forage for food. And you can also add paper shred into the drink carrier part you can hide some treats into there too and that's pretty much the finished toy it doesn't look pretty um birds really don't care what they look like it's just a, a thing for them to chew up so I mean why go out and spend fifty dollars on a brand new toy that looks really nice and you think your birds are going to like it more because it's expensive? No. They're not going to care. Um, they're going to chew it up and destroy it. So why spend that much money on a toy when you can make one yourself for pretty quick and not cost you really anything? I bought the little cups at the dollar store. I bought, I got the straws for free, I got the cardboard for free, and the drink carrier for free. All in all, this toy probably cost maybe a dollar. Maybe. Um, so, if you have any questions, uh, leave a comment. I'm going to do more videos. Um, bear with me. This is the start of them, my first video. So... I will be doing more and hopefully changing and adding to and explain why toys are important maybe in a video also to how to dye the wood I would like to do a video on that for people that like to, to do the dye wood you don't have to birds don't really care um, a lot of birds will just chew it natural so like I said um, if you have any questions, leave a comment. Thank you.